How's it going everybody? This is Richard from Vancouver Velocity Cars. Today I'm going to show you a very exciting newly arrived Navy Blue Subaru Legacy B4. <clears throat> first thing first, the year of this model is 1999 and the reason I'm making a video of this car is the color of this car is pretty unique compared to the regular red or black or silver color on the Legacy and also it has the um, stock 17 inch instead of a 16 inch um, kind of golden rims on the side also this one has low K only 74,000 kilometers with a manual transmission which means it has a lot of more horsepower than an automatic Legacy Before I show you guys the car, just to let you know that uh, Vancouver Velocity Cars is a dealership specialized doing the Japanese import vehicles with a high auction grade. We will show you guys the auction sheet on each car. During the process you are making the courier of our cars. We run fully inspection on these cars, change the tires to brand new make regular maintenance such as oil changes and some maybe sometimes bushings or control arms if it's necessary also all of our cars has already passed the uh, BC government and safety inspection which proved that vehicle is reliable for driving on the road in Canada and you will have no problem to get this vehicle insured here so without further ado let me start off this vehicle show you guys the engine as well as some interior features as you can see this car has the five-speed manual transmission in order to start up the car you have to put your foot on the clutch all the way down and turn the key Very nice and solid sound from startup. Idling is very stable. It has 78,921, so almost 79,000 K. Very quick response on the RPMs. Some interior features such as this photo mirrors. So all you need to do is just press the button on, on the window for your parking convenience. On this side you have your power mirrors and power windows. On the driver's side of course it's automatic up and down. Right here you have your fog lights control and the turn signal as well as the light control will be on your right side because this vehicle is a right hand drive vehicle instead of a local left hand drive. So the turn signal and all the lights control will be on the right side and the wipers will be on the left side. That's the only thing you probably need to, you know, take time to get used to it for the right hand drive vehicle. Other than that, it drives pretty normal as the left hand drive, left -hand drive vehicles. Right here at the center console, you have your air conditioning control. Decrease and increase the fan levels, turn on and turn off the AC, different modes, and change the temperature. Also, just one push of button, you can see the outside temperature. Uh, two defroster for the front and rear windows. Very unique design for the cup holders. Also equipped with a Kenwood, um, which is very nice aftermarket um, entertainment system. Right here, you have another cup holder right here in a deep container, put your coins or cell phone or wallet. Glow box, check it out. It also comes with a fully manual for the Legacy. Down there, you can see this uh, Japanese character. I think it's, this car is was sold in Osaka city in Japan. But anyway, the manual will be in Japanese. So if you guys want to see the full manual, you can always download the PDF version from online. Just easily Google it. 
Right now, let me show you the engine and show you the exterior painting condition, back seat, as well as the trunk. So the Legacy's hood is really heavy. So as you can see, this car has pretty much everything to stock on the engine side. Uh, has the stock boxer as well as their twin turbo engine. And because this Legacy has a manual transmission, which means it has 285 horsepower, um, so the automatic one will be have only 260 or 265. So it's a lot more quicker than the automatic one. You can definitely bring you a sporty driving experience for sure. Full engine sounds pretty solid. It's very clean. Now this Lexi actually the auction grid is uh, 3.5 and interiorly is B. As you can see how the lights are functioning as they're are just turning on. Um, the overall condition of the painting has also been maintained very well. No painting or peeling off and can protect it very well. Some minor scratches like over here but generally speaking overall it's really nice considering about the years 1999 brand new tires on it the back blackout tail lights with a b4 badge on it stock b4 exhaust but you can also hear how this sounds Personally speaking, I like the stock sound of the exhaust. It's kind of low, but sounds powerful. Right here on the side, you have a Subaru stock, uh, the roof side shade for you. So during the, you know, during the raining seasons, you can also roll down your window a little bit, let the air in without let being letting the uh, Rain's coming into your car. Now let's check out the trunk. So you can see they got a huge trunk space in the back. You can at least put almost three, but two should be no problem. Two big luggages in the back. On this side you have your tools, the strat, changing the tires, and here you have your Kenwood unique CD changer right here. So you put your CD in and you will be able to play the music in the front. Down there are some extra containers and a full size spare tire. Very nice. This Subaru definitely has no accident, no rust. It's been fully inspected. If you guys are very interested in a manual Legacy B4, feel free to give me a call. My phone number is 604-366-0951. 604-366-0951. And you're always welcome to drop by at our dealership. We're located at 3888 Marine Way, South Burnaby. And we'll be able to happy to show you guys all the cars we have. As you can see, we have lots of Exotic cars such as Evos, really like this red one, looks awesome. Evo 5, Evo 4, Evo 6, some unique legacy wagons with a with different off the market bag, like spoiler in the back. A lot of some family economic vans, Toyota Previous and Sienna's, Nissan Silvia S15 spec cars, a real spec car, with a turbocharger on it, six speed. And also some Nissan Skyline R34s. Subaru STI over there and some Forsters. Also some European made cars, fun car like this Audi TT. I've been driving it for a while, it's pretty nice. BMW M3, fast car. Some Mercedes G Wagons. Well, thank you guys for watching my video today. Once again, my name is Richard. Thank you so much.